Here we go. We're landing. Clear the runway. Yes, we're gonna make it. Yeah, we made it. We're home free. <laughs> but you know what? I don't know. What? All right. Well, wait, wait, wait. Let me let me tell you something first. You know something? It's it's not gonna be like last time when you and your mommy moved out because you know why? Because you and your your mommy and I we're a family now, and we're gonna st we're gonna stay a family always. Okay? Is that cool? Just let me find. All right. Here you go. It starts in Is Michael ready for the park? Uh, yeah. Want to go for a swing? Get a little fresh air? Maybe you want to take your little boat with you? Right, baby. All right. Thanks. Oh, baby. You want to push the buttons on the elevator like a big boy? All right. Yeah. See you later. Okay. Have fun. Did you get an earful? Yeah. I heard how much you love my son. And how much you miss your dad. I don't know what it's like to be walked away from and sit and, you know, wait for somebody he knows is never gonna show up. And blame himself. We, we've done this, Carter. You'll never leave a hole in my son's heart like your father left in yours. Mike's gone and we're all better off for it. Right. Who are you punishing, Sonny? Mike? Or yourself? So what, you want a job as a, as a shrink now? Don't change the subject. Well, if you want to think about something, then think about, you know, finding a, a company. Why? So you can buy it for me? Well, I'm not going to yank uh, Deception out from under Laura, but, it, it, you know, if you're interested in anything else, let me know. You can't bribe me out of caring for you. Did I say that? You don't want to dream up advertising campaigns, make executive decisions, uh, have meetings about what kind of cosmetics to manufacture, redecorate all the offices. I could do that. I think that I'd be good at it. I know you can. Oh, you do. All of a sudden, all of a sudden now you believe in me. I'm trying. <laughs> I'm trying to buy you a company. You're trying here. to bribe me. You're trying to distract me so that so, I won't care about you. Well, what do you want me to say? You want me to say I believe in you because I do. I've seen how determined you can be, and I'm trying to help you use it in a way that I don't get arrested, you know? So, w would you let me do that? Fine. You wanna buy me a company? Buy me 10. I'll do a good job of them, but you still won't be safe. <laughs> How does that make any sense? Cause I'll still be in your life. I want you in my life, I married you. But you're pushing me away. By giving you what you want? Don't get defensive. I'm not criticizing you. I'm the same. Don't want too much, and you won't be disappointed. Don't believe in anybody completely, and they'll never let you down. Don't put too much faith in that future, and it won't hurt so bad when it all falls apart. What's falling apart here? Hey, I, I asked you about your father, and you asked me if I wanted you to buy me a company. That's the same thing as pushing me away. Where do you come up with this stuff? It's okay, Sonny. I understand. I do the same thing to you sometimes. You don't want to let me get too close. Because it won't hurt you so bad when I leave. I'm going to bail on you. It's all right. The only thing is I'm not bailing. I'm not going anywhere. And I can see that you're hurt, and that means that I'm hurt too. Would you please let me help you? <clears throat> Talk to me. Okay, look. I don't, I don't want you to feel pushed away or shut down, but I really, really need you to leave this alone. Okay. You know what? You can consider yourself off the hook. Thank you. Mm -hmm. 
I gotta meet Benny. Okay. What the? You're absolutely right. It is time for me to take another chance. Mm -hmm. Excuse me. Hi. Sorry to interrupt. Um, do you have a moment? No, I'll, I'll consider the options. Yeah, I was just leaving. I, I, he wanted you to know that you should talk to him as soon as possible, and he stressed he doesn't want you to come. I'll be in touch. Okay. Nice seeing you again. Yeah, you too. Change your mind? I can make deception work. You know my condition. There must be an alternative to working with Carly. Can we please try to find it? Laura... Excuse me, but when I said take a chance, I didn't mean taking money from a no-good gangster. Hey, um, I need to finish this discussion privately. I can handle this. Listen to his nonsense, and then just walk away. See you later, tough guy. <sighs> I'm sorry. <laughs> At least you know uh, up front what you'll be facing with me as a back. I'm worried that my other business interests won't uh, touch deception. Great. Thanks. Okay, so then all we need to discuss then are the conditions, right? You already know mine. Right, you want Carly to be involved. I understand, but I don't think that will work. Why not? I need autonomy, okay? I, I have my own ideas about how deception should be run. But I wouldn't be, I wouldn't be asking you to take the lead if, if uh, I thought it was wrong. You barely even know Carly. Why are you so certain that you, you can't work with her? Barely know her. Then you have no idea what working with her would be like. Is this what she really wants? Well, that's not the point. Yes, it is the point. Wait a minute, I was there when you told her all about it and, you know, she seemed less than thrilled. To yeah. put it mildly. But, but well, well, that, that's because when she knew you didn't want her and, you know, she, she rejected you first because she was protecting herself. So what? She's really a sweet, sensitive girl? <laughs> my, my wife is sensitive. <laughs> Not completely sensitive, but she, she, she's selfish. She's stubborn. She could be a pain in the butt. Uh, manipulative on a good day, crazy on a bad one. Mm. And you want me to go into business with her. But she's smart and loyal, and she stands up. Uh, I'm sorry. She stole her mother's husband. That devastated Bobby's life. And forgive me, but Carly didn't appear to give a damn about that. Then why are they close now? Bobby. Bobby forgave her. But Carly never gave up. I mean, maybe she didn't say the words, but she, she was sorry and she worked hard to get her mother back. I mean, no, no, nobody had less use for Carly than I did. Nobody saw clear what she was all about. But one thing I missed, one thing you're missing now, is she has a lot to offer. Plus, she's a hard worker. She's got a lot of cash. <laughs> I mean, what, what, what more do you want in a partner? Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, I, I think it's so sweet that you want to do this for her, that you want to set her up in business. But I don't think she's going to be the right partner for me. Okay. It's fine. Deal's on the table. If you ever change your mind, you come back to me. I think I'm going to have to pass. No hard feelings. No. Never. All right. Thanks a lot. I'll see you.